Hello everyone and welcome to Werven's World and welcome to my Let's Play series of Serilim 2. So we are at episode 12 already and I think one thing I will change is to get rid of my Gorgon and replace it with my smith here. Um, and the reason for that is... Um, get rid of the Gorgon. Well, she stuns, which is nice, but it's not very reliable. Um, what I want to do is to take... Um, is Brimsmith with me because after my creatures attack they deal additional damage so if I give this one a good artifact basically that would mean my fallen carnage should do more damage as well so I will just try this um, however I need a good attack artifact for that so I might actually craft one because at the moment well this one has attack 27 and I've got attack 28 and attack 10 that's not a lot maybe I can either re-roll them or make a new artifact Mm, that would be with this guy. Reroll. Yeah. So the range is 39 to 65. And at the moment I have... Uh, how do I see that? I've got sword level 4 and 6. Attack 10 and attack 28. Uh, sword level oh here they are these are equipped I guess the ones with the star um, yeah so the these are not very very good um, also the rest of the stats aren't that great so I could just change this one or make another one that I can upgrade later on how much does it cost 500 that's not too bad. How much does it cost to make a sword? It costs 2,500. Yeah, maybe I'll just re-roll this level 4 sword because I can check. Um, this one also has... is level 4. And basically I can add four slots to it with different stuff as well. So later on. So I think I'll just do that. Reroll uh, my level four sword. Because now it's really low, attack 10. 45. That could be a bit higher. 52. Now I'm gonna reroll once more. Yay. Does it always go up? Maybe. Hmm, not 100% sure. Anyway, now we have a stronger artifact. Yay! So then it is artifact, sword, level 4. And we have 58 attack, which we will then give to this guy. And then we can go and kill stuff. He is level not so much as the rest of my things. 15. 26. Um, well, I'm gonna try regardless. Maybe I'll cook a little bit. No, let's immediately go. Uh, level 20. Um, yes, I'll just try it anyway. I'll risk it. Alright, so now this one should do more damage. Yay, that worked. Ooh, new guy. So the 23 was because of the dissection. I hope then if it kills it with that 23, it actually gets another turn. Because otherwise, of course, my plan doesn't work. And I'm gonna attack this one. Oh, I was hoping I wouldn't kill it with, <laughs> with that guy. Um, I'll just attack. Uh. 
but we'll have to find out later. Okay, so let's farm this area a little bit. More creatures. Ooh, a new one. Your creatures have more defense. Interesting. Um, well, I'm gonna kill this one first. Or maybe the Brimsmith first. Oh, that's disappointing. He's got a lot of defense. <laughs> yep. Ooh. Okay, less defense at least. Come on. Acid rain. Some starfire on top of that. There, that works. All right, now kill, kill, kill. Yes, and kill this one, and then extract the other one. Yay! You try. Ooh, twelve damage. That's more than it ever did before. Okay, so it takes a while before the Brimsmith levels up. Every two battles or something. But at least I'm surviving. Hmm. Not nice. Yeah, who to attack? The Griffin is next. But I don't do so much damage to him, I think, because it's a live creature. Oh, but because of my Justicar, that shouldn't matter. Hmm. Well, that didn't work. I, whoa! Oh, I wanted to, to heal. <laughs> Boohoo. Um, do I have any spells? Wow. Come on. Cast molten armor on this guy because he is hopefully going to save the day. <laughs> Otherwise, I might be in trouble. All right. Um, this one's probably pretty weak. This one as well. This one as well. Now ah, they're all tanky because of that guy, of course. There, good. Oh, I can't extract the mimic. This might be a problem. I can't seem to damage him enough because he's got so many buffs. Um, maybe cast this then. Oh, 
but at least does some damage. He's already weak. Um, provoke. Yay, intercepted. Good. Um, at least he didn't regenerate now. Come on. All the creatures on the battlefield will take 20% more damage than normal because they're getting tired. Ah. This guy is tough. Yes, there we go. What did we get? <laughs> Loot its corpse. Ooh, stuff. Exalted emblem. White ember. No artifacts. setup <laughs> okay so I should attack these guys first otherwise I'm gonna get poisoned but I'm not doing any damage Starfire. Yeah, the problem is even if they get school. <laughs> that is mean. Making me all lose a turn, basically. Web, snare. Okay, uh, healing. Yay! All right, uh, wounded, lightly wounded, uh, dodge. Yes. Stop dodging. Mm, no more mana probably. Ah, healing is still possible. Stop dodging, what the hell? Ah, I'm all blinded. I didn't <laughs> look at that. Then it makes sense that it keeps dodging. Mm. At least I guess that's blind, what I have. Yeah, blind. Well, so I should get... See if I can get a spell that can get rid of my status effects. Wow. Um, provoke. This one is not blinded anymore. This one also not, but it's still dodged. There we go, good. Uh, this one invisible, this one has shell, so this guy. Nice. Yeah, just ignores, it's kind of annoying. Mm. <laughs> uh, it's not easy. There we go, good. Grimsmith is leveling up quite okay.
More breeding, any apocalypse and any storm. Ethereal clutcher. I have a storm. I don't think I have an apocalypse. Ooh, hello there. What are you guys? After this creature dies, it has a 50% chance to resurrect. Mm -hmm. Don't plan on dying. Um, creatures can cast major healing and cost zero mana. Interesting. Uh, when this creature attacks, it sacrifices 20% current health and deals and adds 200% of this amount to the damage dealt. Okay, so just pump it full of health and it does a lot of damage. Huh. That's interesting. Um... So who he probably has a lot of health then. Uh, you are arcane, that means you keep getting mana. Well, no. No, he's invisible. Mm, attack. Yay! Uh, cast. Kill this guy. Ooh! Alright, uh, I'll try to attack this guy. Didn't work. Again. Didn't work again. Extract this lizard dude. Bonus extraction, yay! My passives are working. Come on. Well, kill this guy then. Here we go. Yeah, I read on the forums that some people were having a lot of troubles with uh, dodge. That's at some point these ghouls just you can't hit them. But I guess um, that's a good reason to use spells as well because I don't think those can be dodged. Ow! Stop it. Um, ah, dodged. Ooh. He casts molten armor. I could stun it. If that works. It does work. But it mended 153, which is quite a lot. But at the moment I'm doing a fair amount of damage, so that's good. Yay! What's in store for us? And uh, just some resources. Another mimic. Yay, full of mimics here. Oh, come on. Not fair. Nice sleepy. And weak and vulnerable. I uh, still can't extract it, of course. Cast Molten Armor, then. It just <laughs> really helps this Fallen Carnage. First of all, it can't get damaged one time, and it just does a lot of damage. I stun it. And... It has so much health. There we go. Brimstone and brimstone, 500 brimstone. That's not bad at all. Because I've been using quite a bit. Ooh. What class does the planetary amaranth belong to? Uh, live, I guess? Yay. I have no idea what the planetary amaranth is. Is that that kind of wheel thing that we just encountered, maybe? Riddle me this. Hey, hello. Um, yo. 
Uh, <laughs> cool. Oh, cool. Um, you. Now can, we can see if... It, no, I don't get an extra turn. Okay, so the dissection actually doesn't give me an extra turn. That's too bad. It basically happens after the turn of the of the fallen carnage. Well, that's good to know, but it's unfortunate. Um, yeah, this one doesn't do a lot of damage, so I can try to get rid of one of these shells. So then my Ghost Watcher can attack it, but not get it. You can try to get rid of a shell. Oh, it's dodged. Oh, so I actually need to do damage in order to get rid of it. That's fair enough. Hmm, but then we have to think of if we want to keep the Brim Smith. If it doesn't really help the Fallen Carnage that much, maybe there's another creature that just gives it like a flat amount of attack. Instead of attack after it at actually attacks. Um, getting a lot of favor here. Ooh, my merchant district is done. Hooray. More merchants. I'm not sure what they sell, but awesome. Anyway. Yay. Um, well, first we will finish this level. How much does my... My necklace still needs al almost half. So that'll be still be a while. But then it will hopefully be worth it. Because it cost me a ton of resources. Ooh. Crusader Pit Wraith Obliberator. Wizard hat. Mm hmm. Alright, we finished the Death Realm and we are now in the next level, level 21. We need to go to 23 for the boss, but I think I'll just do this one and then go back to Serum. Ooh, teleporters. And these we've all seen before. Multicast. Stop dodging. Uh, cast. Yes, molten armor. I have to find something that gives more mana to my fortress because at the moment he can only cast one time molten armor and then he's kind of out of mana. Um, which is not great. Oh, he resurrected. Yeah, maybe I should focus on this guy. Come on. See if I can extract it. Yes, there we go. Hmm. Stuff. More power. Yeah, power is always welcome because then we can start new rituals. Yay, 304 energy for my rituals. Ooh, another creature. Looks dangerous. After attacking a creature with less than 25% health, kill it. Then heal your creatures for 100% health. Interesting. Mm, I will first kill stuff. Such as the harpy. This one is first. Ooh, nice. Mm, well, maybe this guy can kill it. Yes, good. So then the Crypt Bat will attack next. Ah, dodging. Cast. Molten Armor. Ah, 
uh, Starfire. And now actually that red guy should have quite some damage already. Ooh, come on. There we go. Extract, nope. Try again. Yes, perfect. Yay. Level 23 already, my smith. Ooh, I have to recruit these knights as a quest. I call to our arms quest. Awesome, I did the last night and I think I'll get one of his creatures. Hey, ooh, and a ball. Multicast, that means less intelligence, but more, more casts. I need to get a trial. Hmm. Um, who to try and kill? Ooh, this guy is new. Wyvern Sonic Screecher. I dodge. <laughs> and dissection, yay. Mm -hmm. Um. Hmm. Who then? Forest Priest. He's next. Yay, dissection again. Good. Uh, yeah, try and kill this guy. You can try and cast something. Let's see, with multicast. Uh, so now I can try to extract this guy. Yay, perfect. So that means Starfire should... That probably also does less damage because I have less intelligence because of multicast, I guess. Oh well. Uh, now, anyway, I should be able to kill stuff. Yeah, and I was thinking, um, I keep casting Molten Armor on um, my guy, but actually if I cast Acid Rain, the enemies lose defense, so that helps everyone and not just my uh, Fallen Carnage. So I think I'll just continue doing that. Ooh, any Carnage and any Ifrit. Carnage Destructor. Cool. Do I have an Ifrit? I don't think so. I have a Djinn. Here's some kind of teleporty thing, but I'll first go to the uh, altar to claim my reward. Uh, where was that though? There. Alteration magic, yay! This might actually be a quite nice thing to come back to because you get those spheres that give you energy for your rituals. Pit Wraith Redeemer, that sounds interesting. Uh, library, creature, bestry. Uh, Pit Wraith Redeemer. Oh, hello, you look cool. This creature's attacks afflict vulnerable for five turns. Hm. Respected by Vertrag. Alright, I'm going to find that portal and see if we can do something cool there, like kill bosses. Ooh, he looks kind of evil tree. Hemlock Ant. <laughs> okay, um, what do you do, Hemlock Ant? Ooh. Uh, well, first kill some stuff. You're probably fairly weak. That's strong enough to survive this.
Mm, who then? Maybe the... This guy. In the hope that I can kill him, but probably not. Oh. I really like that my Carnage casts weak and vulnerable on them. That's quite really nice. Uh, kill. Yes. Extract. Yay! Uh, cast. Starfire. Nice. Stealing my mana. There we go. Yay. Ooh, bow, attack and speed. Brimstone gained, less damage taken. Meh. Any storm plus any watcher is hurricane. Cool. Death shield. Trade cataclysm. I wish I could see what these trades do. Um, blistering radiance. Ooh, that costs a lot of mana though, but it's a large amount of damage. Mm, more cloth scraps. Your creatures gain a moderate amount of intelligence. Cool. Um, creatures. What do you have? You gain health, mana, and some stuff. I think we can find you something better. Something with intelligence, because then you'll do more damage with the Starfire. Intelligence 12, Intelligence 28. 19. 36. Start battle with Splash, that's not that interesting for me. 45. I think I'll go for this one, because then I also gain another spell slot. Yes. That does mean I gain way less power and energy, though, which is a bit annoying. But, well, um, then spell gems. Um. Ooh. What is my starfire now? Duration increased by one. I want to cast it when I'm hit. And then... Mm, yeah, either everyone takes a lot of damage. Or... Resurrection, which is also not bad. With a large amount of health. Maybe I'll do Resurrection just to make sure. Spellbound. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Maximum health 145. That's quite a bit. That would mean a lot of health for you. Um Cain Mendon hit. Yes, here you go. Awesome. Mm, yes, I think we'll kill these guys. Oh. Mm. Ouch. Acid rain. Because now everyone gets less defense, so that's also good for my other creatures, not just for my fallen carnage. And then this guy can do some star firing. No, he, no, he can't. For why not? Not enough mana. 38. Oh, <laughs> it actually costs more mana than I have. Uh, well, then just extract something. Uh, this guy. See if I can make a complete worm team at some point. Yeah. 
There we go. Oh, almost full. Yes, cool. Then we will go back to Cyrilim and we will finish our ritual. And we can start a new one because I have a fair amount of stuff. Um, Altar of Blood. Increase the difficulty of realms, more rewards, citizen recruitment, improve foraging, salvaging, quantity of materials, more merchants or more cooking. Well, what do the merchants do? Let's see if we can find them. Where would they be? Probably in a bar or uh, all the same people. Okay. Um, were you always here? Level 20 Sigil. Yes, I would like to do those sigils, but I keep being too high level for them. Um, so I need to change my team for them, I guess. Um, so I don't really gain extra reward. But that's something to look out for if we make a new team with new things, then we could do that. Oh, here's the merchants. Hello. Only one. What do you have for sale? Ah, just random items. Ooh. That's not bad at all. <laughs> but it costs 5,000 of each resource. No thanks. I'll do with what I have. Hmm. I have a quest from this guy, but I don't see it anymore. Maybe I fix it? Oh, that's a priest vizier. This guy wanted some kind of a troll something, right? Troll ale master. All right. Well, that I'll have to wait for next time because we haven't found one yet. So yeah, I'll put the episode to a close. So I hope you had fun and see you next time.